Welcome to the channel. This is Technoscope. Like to see the other cool products and projects we're working on? Visit the Technoscope Amazon store where you can find everything discussed in this video, the equipment we use, and swag for all Twisted Curve YouTube channels. Welcome everybody to Technoscope. My name is Elemento and today I'm coming to you with a short tutorial on how to fix the problem with Precision X1, the new version, which somehow for keeps forgetting your settings. Now, uh, I, I have to preference this saying that I use the um, Steam version so that Steam automatically updates this software for me without me having to download the new version every time a new version comes out. So if you download yours manually from the EVGA website, your results may vary. But for those who use the Steam version as I do and are having this problem with every time it updates, it loses all your settings. This is a quick and easy fix for it. Now keep in mind, this may or may not work for different versions. So I'm also including a backup system. So the first thing you want to do is go to your C drive, users, your, your profile, which in this case is Twisted Curve. And what you'll need to do is up here on the view tab, you'll need to go over here and check hidden items, which will show the hidden folders. The one that you're looking for is app data, or you could simply type it in if you want to. We'll also go to local and then we'll go down here to where it says EVGA underscore company dot comma underscore limited. And we'll select that one. And this is the folder for the data for Precision X. And as you can see, there are multiple folders in this folder. The problem that we're having or that I'm having is when the software updates, it creates a new folder each time. So I created my preferences originally in 0.3.17.0 and then they updated to 0.3.19.0 and all of a sudden all of my settings were gone and I'm like, hey, WTF, what's going on here? And I contacted EVGA and they were just like, their their solution was to just download the, the version from their website instead of using the Steam version. I don't even understand how that's a solution. Why why even have it on Steam? So anyway, what, I'm, what I did was I went, when the new version came out, 4.4.0, a couple days ago, all of my settings were gone. I already knew what was happening because I researched this issue the first time it happened. So... What you'll want to do is go into your previous folder and you'll see that it says user.config. It creates this user.config each time a new version is installed. And that is the reason that you are losing your settings. So what you want to do is copy this file. I've already done it, so I'm not going to do it here, but you want to, you want to copy this file and then go into the new version and it will have the same file as well. So what you'll do is you'll take the user.config that's already in this folder before you copy, before you paste anything, take the one that's already in this folder, just rename it and type .bak, which is the universal backup uh, symbol for uh, file extension. And that will save your original. You do not want to delete this and just in case you need to fall back on it because maybe the user config on the last version is not compatible with the new version. So user.config.bak. And then you want to paste the old version onto into this folder. And what you'll have to do, uh, or what you should have done, excuse me for not saying this, what you should have done is you should have closed this program before you copied and pasted. Um, just go ahead. Uh, if you haven't already done that, close it, reopen it, and it should reopen with your old settings back intact. If not, then unfortunately you'll have to uh, re-enter those settings, which I know can be time consuming and a pain in the butt, especially if you're using a production computer such as Sledgehammer here, uh, which is, you know, it's a problem when it goes down and I need those settings because this computer needs to be ready to go. But uh, I hope this short tutorial helped you guys out. Um, if you liked it, please subscribe guys. I have many more of these coming. Uh, and go ahead, hit the thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next video. My name is Elemento, and this is Technoscope. Technoscope.
Audioscope is a Twisted Curve production.